Welcome back to the show. If you have chronic sinus problems, you're probably looking for relief wherever you can find it. For sure. Well, now there's a new high-tech method, but it is available only in a few places. One of those places is an advanced ear, nose, and throat specialist, also known as Advent. And Dr. Muthan Kandula is here to explain. Nice to have you this morning. Nice to be here. So we explain this military connection. Right. There's some kind of, I don't know, provocative statements about guided imagery and smart right. bombs that I'm right. reading about. What's <laughs> yeah. the connection? between well, the military use and help for our sinuses. Well, it's, it, the concept is the same as a smart bomb, which is basically what we're doing at this type of surgery is using a CT scan at the time of surgery, and I'm able to pinpoint where I'm at based on the CT scan. So I can I can point to spots in, in the inside of surgery on the inside of a, of a patient and find exactly where I am. So it's it's kind of like a GPS system is the way I usually describe it to, to a patient. Okay. This sounds totally new. Is this groundbreaking stuff? Because I know you're well known for using, you know, high tech, um, uh, surgeries and techniques at your office. Yeah, it's it's actually it's it's it is groundbreaking, but it's been around for a while. I've actually trained on it for about ten years now. Um, it's becoming more and more you know widely adopted. Uh, so conceptually, it's still pretty new out there, but uh, you know I'm pretty familiar with it. And how does it work? How can you, how are you able to target basically sp specific areas in surgery and then avoid more sensitive areas? Yeah, this is kind of showing it. What we do every patient has a, has a uh, has sinus surgery has a CT scan done, and with this what we're doing is literally, you can see that monitor up there, um, using the scan that somebody's had before surgery and we, we pinpoint spots on their face and uh, calibrate it. So once it's calibrated, then whatever instrument I'm using, it's able to I'm able to point to where I where I want to be and where I don't want to be. And what are the benefits to the patient in particular that you're able to target certain areas so specifically? Well, the biggest benefit is we were able to get to the, the problem area and keep the, the good stuff Oh, oh, you know, sort of Intact. safe, exactly. Okay. And there are, I mean, there, there there are very sensitive areas next to the sinuses, so you know we don't often come across those. But uh, the bottom of the brain is there, the eyes are there. So there's very you know high ticket items that you want to try to try to avoid at at all costs. Mm -hmm. And then can guided sinus surgery be used in combination with other techniques too? Yeah, absolutely. We've talked about balloon sinuplasty mm -hmm. in the past, and it, it it's. You know, I guess the best way to describe it is with image guided surgery and balloon sinuplasty, we're able to combine a lot of things together, and it makes you know each patient is different, each patient's problem is different, uh, problems are different, and we're able to target those based on on you know the technology we have nowadays. And it sounds so groundbreaking and new, but yet you said just a, a few minutes ago you've been training for more than ten. New or it is new. I mean, it's it's new. You know, when I was first training on it, it was just getting it was just being introduced, and um, you know, throughout my training, so during residency, we used it um, extensively. So I'm used to it. I'm, I'm, it's sort of old hat to me, but um, you know, it's still one of those things that's being you know sort of brought out in different uh, different areas, and it, it's it's new. It's getting better as time goes on. I think it's probably gotten as as good as it's going to get, and it's really great a great uh, benefit to me and my patients. Yeah. yeah, and another aspect of all this is the use of a mini cap. Mm -hmm. What's a mini cat? The mini cat is a, is a miniature CT scanner that uh, we've got in our office, and um, what it allows us to do is we can do the scan that just shows the image of the scan, scanner there. We can do the scan in our office, um, use that very same scan at the time of surgery. It's a, it's very convenient, uh, number one, but more, more importantly for me, it's very uh, very efficient, very effective as far as use of technology goes. And for the, the patient, what are the advantages of being able to use a mini cat, which I know is small, it's mm -hmm. office based, mm -hmm. like you said, and it, but yet it has probably the benefits of, of, a, of a much bigger scan. Yeah, exactly. I mean, it's the same information that we're getting off a bigger scanner, a tenth the, the dose of the radiation, which is a big deal. So, you know, it, it's, it, you want to minimize radiation at all costs, but you want to have good quality scans, and this allows us to do that, so we're able to use the technology, uh, utilize that, and, and leverage that for uh, for the patients. And with with the scan, how does that play a role in the guided sinus surgery? So everybody who has sinus surgery has a CT scan. Everybody who has image guided sinus surgery has a CT scan. What we're doing is we're using that scan, and that's that is allowing me to navigate myself uh, during the time of surgery. So it's like if you have a GPS system in your car and you're driving down the street, and it tells you sort of where to go. This mm -hmm. shows me; it sort of confirms and uh, for me where I'm I'm at and um, make sure I'm targeting their pro the patient's problems specifically. And you mentioned that there's such a, the, the amount of radiation is so much lower. What about the cost comparison between the mini cat and a, and a bigger scan? Yeah, it's usually about half the cost, um, which is a big deal too. So, I mean, it's it's convenient. It's, it's I've got the information right in front of me right there. Uh, we've got the information sort of in one spot to take to, to the OR when somebody needs to go to surgery. Um, and, and we've always got that information to go back to, say somebody needs a, a, a scan after surgery 
surgery, uh, which which happens sometimes, and we've got to, we we are able to compare that immediately to to, to their pre-op scans. Mm -hmm. And is the Minicat available elsewhere? Um, there's there's one other um, center up in northern Wisconsin that has it, but we, we've got the only one in southern Wisconsin. So. And it's a good reason for people to visit you. I think I'm going to make sure people have the information so that they can ask questions and chat with you. And it's not always a, a referral, right? They can come directly sure. to Absolutely. Advent too. Okay, here's the information for Advent. Um, the web address is advent.md and they're located on Mayfair Road. The phone number there is on your screen. It's 414-771-6780. Always nice to have you. Thank you. Thanks for being here.